Hello YouTube, Catman here. Today I'm gonna check out a uh, newly discovered bottle dump. So someone, I was selling bottles recently for a tax sale and someone came over and they had already contacted me in advance on Facebook and told me they had moved recently but they knew about a bottle dump near their house. And they were going to tell me about it. So he gave me the location. So I'm heading there now. It's about a 2.7 mile walk from my house. Hopefully I can find it. And hopefully it's good. Based on what he described about the bottles, it is probably about a 30s or 40s dump. At least that's the newest stuff in there is. It could be late throws or it could be layered. But I'm pretty excited. I'm still looking for the dump and look what I just found. This is interesting. I don't know if I'm at a bottle dump or not. Look, it says Rapid Dayton. Rapid Dayton. Look at that PSI. Some sort of motor. I don't know what that is. There's a brick, but it seems to be blank. Let's double check that there's no dump here. So I don't think I reached the dump. Just based on what I remember of the direction. And then, but there's something over there too, an old well. Okay, let's keep going. The thing is, the area he circled on the map for me, that there was no trail there, and he said it was off of a trail. So I'm, I've gone to the nearest trail to there. Oh, look at that. This is a trail right past, like literally with one house in between the trail and where he circled. So, along the trail, I think I remember him saying to go until it reaches a fork and then go left. But, into the woods, but I'm not sure. But I'm gonna check there. And if I don't find it, I'll walk home. I've already gone over four miles and it's eight in the morning. I left at like 6.40. So I had trouble sleeping, it was about 3 in the morning. So I came back up to where I found that thing with the meter on it, and I found this right past it. And it's also probably gonna give up soon. I'm back, guys. I haven't found a dump, but look what I just found. Please behold. Oh, schmip. I was so excited. It looked whole. Oh, no. Look at that, it's broken in half. Lamty hell. AT&T. Another piece is not here. Oh my god. I got so excited. I hope there's more where that came from. <sighs> that was disappointing. I got so excited. Hello YouTube. I'm back with a quick review. Yep. Unfortunately, I only found one bottle, but it's a pretty cool one. Unfortunately, the label's not in great condition. Let's go in the light so you can see it better. It says... Peekskill quality beverages. Peekskill is a town near me, so that's cool. It's from 1957, according to the date code, which I looked up. It says, oh, hey, Lonkai. It's my big buddy, Dookie. Uh, it says, for a delightful drink, ask for Peekskill quality beverages. In which twirf, and I can't tell what that says. Here's the base. It's a Glenshaw Glass Company, which you can find the date code online. It has a letter on the crown, which will tell you the date for the date card. Yeah, and that's all. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.